Hey everybody, you know that I'm not the biggest gym rat in the world. I just woke up like this, you know? I just, this is just all natural. I don't not go to the gym because I think it's bad to go to the gym exactly. It'd probably be good if I were just a big beefcake. I don't go to the gym because, you know, I'm just like kind of lazy in the morning and I, I don't want to go. Now I have another reason not to go to the gym because my friends who do work out tell me that an evil creature has infested gymnasia around the country and that would be TikTok girls. They go and they harass men and they make guys who just want to go pump a little iron, get some blood flowing. They make them feel like weirdos and creeps and it's got to stop. So we will examine this phenomenon. Take it away with the first TikTok. This is how to not approach girls at the gym. I hate this, I hate this, I hate when there's weirdos. So he's so uncomfortable. Feral, 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 like feral. Excuse me? You don't have to do that, it's okay. No, no, it's okay, I got it. Thank you though. Why do men and women go to the same gym? This seems like a recipe for disaster. From what I can tell, the thing that this woman is complaining about is that she went to a place where men are getting blood pumping, testosterone bursting through their bodies, and then these women show up wearing dental floss, and they kind of prance and jiggle around a little bit. And then, believe it or not, the men sometimes look at them. And this is very bad. They definitely don't want that. That's why they're wearing very tight, skimpy outfits and going to the men's gym for some reason and filming themselves because they hate, they obviously hate that male attention, <laughs> right? This could easily be solved though by just having different gyms for men and women. I don't want to have women looking at me while I'm pumping iron. That's not what I'm there for. By the way, she's saying this guy's really creepy because he comes over to her to help her out. Men help each other out in the gym. Even if this were an all-male gym, the guy would come over, hey, you need some help with the way it's, hey, you need a spotter, you need, that's like a normal thing. <laughs> that women trying to destroy. These, this specific subset of TikTok women. Next one. I'm so uncomfortable right now. I'm so uncomfortable that I'm going to set up a film shoot specifically to catch men looking at me. I'm going to I'm going to display myself for men and then for the whole world, that's how uncomfortable I am. Obviously she's not uncomfortable. Obviously she's very comfortable and she's exploiting these poor guys and it's like, you know, dangling a nice juicy cupcake in front of a glutton, you know, and saying, "Hey, Hey, why are you looking at the cupcake? That's a crazy thing, of course. When I say that men and women shouldn't use the same gyms, you maniac! people are probably going to call me the Taliban or something. They're going to say I want to impose Sharia law or something like that. I'm just hearing what the women are saying. Is the woman's solution that men should stop being attracted to women? Well, the libs have done a decent job of spreading that through society, but it's, it's not ever going to actually work. If this is really bothering certain women, there's a very simple answer. Maybe men and women should have at least certain spaces that are a little bit separate, particularly spaces where they're not wearing a lot of clothing and they're sweating and they've got all sorts of hormones <laughs> and, and blood and everything pumping through them and they're feeling very virile and energized. Maybe that would be a good idea. Maybe, it turns out, older times with more modest cultures, maybe they weren't just totally crazy. Maybe they understood a little something about human nature that we have forgotten. Right now, go to genucell.com slash KnowlesYT. As you might know, we are all big fans of our friends over at Genucell. Don't just take my word for it. Ella from Rockford says, quote, I have both age and acne spots, and this stuff is actually fading both of them. This serum is worth every penny. Ella is raving about the famous dark spot corrector from Genucell, a must-have after months of record heat and humidity. Sunspots, brown spots, discoloration, and even red inflamed patches all disappear in front of your very eyes. And here's the Genucell amazing guarantee. You will see results on day one or your money back. So take advantage of Genucell's most popular package, which now includes the dark spot corrector plus the classic Genucell bags and puffiness treatment and immediate effects, all at about 70 70 
0% off, so you can try the best skincare in the world for yourself, completely risk-free. It's simple. Go to GenuCell.com slash YT and start looking years, even decades younger tomorrow. Say goodbye to dark and liver spots, bags, and puffiness under the eyes, crow's feet at GenuCell.com slash YT. GenuCell.com slash Knowles, letter Y, letter T encountered a gym creeper today. Obviously, this guy's not dressed for a good workout. Put a pause there. That is a great workout outfit. Why is that not workout gear? That's It's very casual. The shirt doesn't have a collar. It doesn't have any buttons. He's wearing blue jeans. It's not like he's wearing wool trousers. That looks perfectly appropriate to me. Why is she staring at him? She's so upset that he's staring. Why is she staring at him and ogling him and objectifying him? Hmm? Next video. Because you're somewhat attractive, at least, and aren't wearing a lot of clothing. I guess that's the answer to all of these. And it's something that women have been doing since the dawn of time, and it's kind of charming when they're young women doing it, when, you know, when you're in high school, and you say, tee-hee, why are boys looking at me, tee-hee-hee? But it's much less charming as you grow up and become an adult and should know the answer to that question. Why are men paying attention to you? Because you are, you are doing the sorts of things that demand the attention of men. That's why. What, am I like hot or something? Tee-hee-hee. <laughs> yes. Will, it, will you feel better if I say yes? Sure. That's why. Oh, what? You think I'm like pretty? Tee-hee-hee. Yeah, I guess so. That's so weird. Yeah, okay. Okay, lady. <laughs> can we, <laughs> can our culture in any way mature past the age of 16? I'm no longer convinced. We need a girls only gym. We need a girls only gym in Trinidad. Or we need the existing gyms to give us like days of the week that we could go to when no guys are going to be in the gym. Can we get this? Please. Great idea. Yeah, that's great. She, okay, she's. I, I, don't, I wouldn't classify her as one of the gym girls. She's like the opposite of these gym girls. Because these gym girls are going there intentionally to just humiliate men. The reason a man goes to the gym is to be excellent. To engage in physical excellence so that he can look better and be healthier and feel better. And what these women are doing is showing up and trying to undercut and humiliate them at every single step of the way. And to tantalize them and tease them and, and distract them from what they're actually there to do. If a guy wants to pick up a girl, he's gonna go to a bar, he's gonna go to a club, he's gonna go to, I don't know, some guy, if he's more wholesome, he'll go to the church picnic. But he's gonna go to a place where that sort of thing is intended to happen. That's not his primary motivation for going to the gym. So then that lady comes around, she goes, hey, if this is a problem, we should just have separate gym hours or separate gyms, right? Yeah, totally. But none of these TikTok girls are gonna want that. If the men and the women went to different gyms or the same gym at different times, they would lose all their likes and their views. Watch this guy try move to me at the gym. Oh, Lord. Okay, this is not, Checks this is not fit for nothing on his phone the queen. Me being busy sorting my wrist straps. I'm legitimately gonna stop. This is not conducive to virtue to look at this video. I'm gonna look into the camera instead. Sad lip. Why, why did she place the camera there? Why that angle? Why those shorts? Why? It, it's true that men need to avert their eyes sometimes if something's a little bit attractive. Frank! What? Not a lot of like things anymore? Women can help, though. You know, you can, I'm, yes, the man has the responsibility to be in control of his lusts and things like that. The women have a responsibility not to wear that and film that from that camera angle, lady, also because it undercuts the argument that they don't want male attention. They crave it, and we shouldn't give it to them. We should listen to that Trinidadian lady and get separate gym hours. And then all my friends who go to the gym can tell me about how it works out. See you next time. A day may come when the courage of men fail, but it is not this day.